Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Power Platform TV. So uh, today we're gonna take a look at the post-conversation survey. Okay, so we looked at the pre-conversation survey or pre-chat survey uh, in a previous video. And today we're gonna take a look at the post-conversation survey. So this is basically uh, what will appear to the user, uh, to, the, to the customer, once the chat's complete, right? So once the agent ends the chat, they're going to get the survey and then they can fill it out and rate the experience of the chat basically or anything else that you as an organization would like to ask the customer. So to, to set this up, let's go and head over to our chat. Uh, this is the one we created previously, the website chat. To use the post conversation survey, what we're going to do is we're going to turn this on here. And here we get to uh, select a Dynamics 365 customer voice survey, right? So what we can do is we can uh, click on this button here and this is gonna open the uh, customer voice in a totally new tab. And um, that way we don't have to get that message when we navigate away from this record, right? Uh, so if we click on here, it'd be cool if uh, these buttons were kind of implemented in more places in D365, right? So so this is the um, basically customer voice. And what we can do is we can go ahead and create a new project here and uh, we get these project templates. I'm gonna select the support template here. This is probably the most applicable one in our scenario. And I'm gonna click next. And then I need to just select the environment. So I'm gonna click on all here, grab the trial that I am uh, working in, click select and close. Now I'm in that org, click create. And now it's going to uh, bring up this, uh, this template of this survey that I can use. So you may, uh, in your org, it may take a little bit more time to go through these steps. I find that the first time that it uh, runs, it has to do some setup in the background, but eventually you're going to get through to, to this kind of setup, okay? So what we see here is um, this is a uh, template and it has some, some questions that are already uh, out of the box, you know, basic stuff like how do you rate your overall, overall experience, that kind of thing, right? And... Um, that all looks good to us and it's been saved up here. So what we can do is we can navigate back to the uh, Omnichannel administration and we can just go ahead and apply this uh, survey to this post-conversation survey, right? Uh, we do get a couple of options here. How should we send the survey? And then like the message here. Um, we have the option here to send the survey link to conversation or uh, I really like this one, insert uh, survey in the conversation, right? So I'm gonna do that one and it's actually gonna embed the uh, customer voice survey right within the chat widget. It's really cool. Uh, so we'll take a look at that. So I'm gonna click save here and that's all ready to go. So now we can go over to the chat widget and uh, take a look at this. Okay, so now let's go ahead and try this out. So I'm back on the chat page and um, I'm going to click on the chat here and I'm going to select support and click submit so that this uh, chat gets routed to one of our support agents. And if I open up uh, the uh, Omnichannel for Customer Service app for this agent that's the support guy, I'm going to click on accept here to this chat and the chat's uh, been engaged now. I'm going to say hi and let's say hi here and maybe the uh, the agent identifies the caller somehow, uh, like so, and he's chatting with the caller. And then I'm not gonna go through the whole scenario, but you know, let's say that the uh, chat gets resolved, right? So this, the, the customer gets the support help that they need, right? So once, that they're, once they're done, the agent can go ahead and end the conversation by clicking on the end button here, right? And over here on the chat, you can see that what pops up is the survey, right? So it's popping up and it says, um, hi, uh, we appreciate your business. And then uh, goes through and asks them uh, all of the questions that we um, wanted to ask them, right? So I'm just gonna go here and, uh, and fill this out. I'm gonna give it five stars and uh, I'm gonna say as expected. And let's say uh, very satisfied and uh, very satisfied and very satisfied and uh, neutral. And then uh, how can we improve our service? Uh, nothing to add. 
let's say, and now I'm going to submit this, right? So this survey gets submitted now. You can see how cool that was. It's, it was embedded right within the chat there. And now if we go over to customer voice over here, uh, what we can do, this is our survey. We can click on the case resolution survey here and we can see that uh, we have a total of one responses and then it's giving us some some information here about the uh, about what was entered right um, and then you can go over here and you can see some more information and uh, so forth right so uh, really cool how you can tie this in customer voice with the uh, omnichannel post conversation surveys hope you guys enjoyed it so that's it guys, if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and of course check out my blog at carldesouza.com.